Bottle top Bill and his best friend Corky up on the hill. Let's watch them as they play. Play it all day. Hooray. The adventures of Bottle Top Bill and his best friend Corky. Bottle top Bill. And today's adventure is called A Day at the Sea. Where's the adventure going to start, Bill? It's going to start right here, Corky. In our very own home. <laughs> Guess which room we're in. Uh, the bathroom? No. The kitchen? No. I know. The attic. Spot on, Corky. And it's time to give the attic a good clean. It's a big job, Bill. It certainly is, Corky. <laughs> So let's get cracking. I'll clean this furniture. And I'll tidy up these boxes. I like looking through old things, Corky. You never know what interesting thing you might find. This could be an interesting old thing right here, Bill. It's an old picture. That's my great uncle Reg. He loved going on adventures. Careful, Bill. Oh no, Corky. I've broken it. It's okay, Bill. I think I can mend it. I sure hope so, Corky. There, Bill. It's as good as new. Paint me pink. Look behind the picture, Corky. It's a map. Better than that, Corky. It's a treasure map. A treasure map? Yeah. See this big cross? That means Great Uncle Reg must have hidden some treasure there a long, long time ago. Oh. Should we try to find the treasure, Bill? I think we should, Corky. It will be a great adventure. Then let's go on a treasure hunt. The first thing we have to do, Corky, is find a place to start our treasure hunt. Right, Bill. I wonder where that is. The map says that we must start our treasure hunt at a little apple tree. Do you see a little apple tree, Corky? I only see this big apple tree, Bill. This is a puzzle. We have to think. Bill! Maybe this big apple tree is the little apple tree. What do you mean, Corky? When Great Uncle Reg made the treasure map, the big apple tree was only little. It's grown up since then. You're right, Corky. This must be the tree. We start over here and go to there. How far do we have to go? 100 steps, Corky. Let's count. One, two, three... Eighty-four, eighty-five, eighty-six, eighty-seven, eighty-eight... Uh, Bill? Eighty-nine, ninety. Paint me double pink, Corky. It's the sea. I don't understand, Bill. The map says to take 100 steps from the apple tree. But I only got to 90. This needs even more thinking, Corky. Maybe we have to keep walking into the water. That must be it, Corky. But we'll need some air to breathe. And helmets to see properly. Ready, Corky? Ready, Bill. Now, what did I count up to, Corky? Ninety, Bill. Right, ninety. Ninety-one, ninety-two, ninety-three... 94, 95. Wait a minute, Bill. Let's just see where we are. We're under the sea, Corky. I know that, Bill, but let's look at what's down here. I see lots of sand and rocks, Corky. And lots of underwater plants, too. I didn't know so many plants grew under the sea. What's that over there, Bill? They're fish, Corky. The sea's full of fish. They come in all different shapes and colours and sizes. Whoa! OK, Bill. Keep counting. 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. What does the map say we do now, Bill? 
It says, look for the clue to unlock the mystery of the treasure. What does that mean? I don't know, Corky. This treasure hunting sure needs a lot of thinking. Look at that. What is it, Corky? It's an old shipwreck. Could that be where the clue is? There's only one way to find out. Let's go and have a look. Ooh, looks a bit scary, Bill. Don't worry, Corky. Let's take a look inside. Are you sure it won't be scary, Bill? Of course not, Corky. What could possibly be inside this shipwreck that would be scary? I don't know, Bill. I hope you're right. Trust me, Corky. I am absolutely, completely and totally right. I think this is the captain's cabin, Bill. And I think this floor slopes, Corky. Bill, watch out! An octopus! Grab me, Bill! Thanks, Corky. Let's go before the octopus wakes up. But what about the clue to the treasure? You're right, Corky. We have to find the clue that unlocks the mystery of the treasure. Bill, look at that key. A key? A key can unlock things, Corky. That must be it. I almost got it. Bill, I think we're in trouble. Whoa! Oh. Uh, hello, Mrs Octopus. I'm Corky. And I'm Bill. We're sorry for waking you. We just wanted to borrow that key. Please. Please? We need it for our treasure search. Thank you, Mrs... Uh, uh. Mrs Grumbles, we won't disturb you anymore. Would you like to come with us to find the treasure, Mrs Grumbles? Come on, then. Let's go. We might need a push, Mrs. Grumbles. I think this is the right way, Corky. The map says we have to pass the old anchor. And there's the old anchor. Well spotted, Bill. What's next? Now we have to find the rocky caves. Rocky caves? Where could they be? Oh! It's a dolphin, Bill. Wow. I've never met a dolphin before, Corky. Can you tell us the weight of the rocky caves, dolphin? <coughs> Thank you very much, Mr. Dolphin. <coughs> Would you like to come with us, Mr. Dolphin? <coughs> the more the merrier. Let's go. Look at all these caves, Bill. This must be the place. Great Uncle Reg's map says that the treasure's in one of them. There are so many caves. Where do we start to look? The map says it's no ordinary cave. It's a whale cave. Do whales live in caves, Bill? I don't think they do, Corky. What could the clue mean? There's someone down here, Bill. Maybe they can help us. Who is it, Corky? I think... I'm not sure. It's a crab. Pardon me, Miss Crab. I'm sorry for sticking my nose into your home. Maybe you can help us, Miss Crab. We're looking for a whale cave. What's she doing? She wants us to follow her, Bill. Then let's follow her. Now I understand, Corky. The whale cave is shaped like a whale. Do we have to go inside the whale cave, Bill? We sure do, Corky. Would you like to come with us? Let's go find the treasure. We won't be long, I hope. I can't see any treasure, Corky. Whoa! I think you found the treasure, Bill. I think you're right, Corky. It's a treasure chest. This is it, Corky. A real treasure chest. 
What's that? It's a submarine. And I think it's going to hit our cave. <laughs> It's no good, Bill. These rocks won't move. Hello, friends. Are you out there? We need some help moving these rocks. Do you think they can do it, Bill? I sure hope so, Corky. You did it! Fantastic! Thanks a lot, friends. If you hadn't helped us, we'd never have escaped. Now we can share what we found. The treasure! Use the key to open the chest, Bill. It's jewellery. And it's made of old shells. Shells? Just old shells? That's not much treasure, Corky. But look, Bill. <laughs> Our friends love the shells. <laughs> it might be treasure for us, Corky, but it sure is treasure for them. Enjoy your treasure, friends. We're glad you like it. You know, Bill, I think we found something even better than treasure. You do? We found three new friends. Spot on, Corky. Bye, friends. Hope we see you soon. I think friends are the best treasure of all, Bill. <laughs> when you're right, Corky, you're right. Buttercup Bill and his best friend Corky. See you again.